Hello and welcome. This is Kara and it's Friday and I have a freebie for today. Yay! Today's freebie is kind of the kickoff for the 13 days of Halloween tags, which I am super excited about. <laughs> Yay! It's finally here. Um, I just wanted to show you my almost completed box. I decided to use the Tim Holtz word there. I worked on this uh, on my live on Tuesday, so <laughs> you are brave. <laughs> you can go and check that out. And there's the back. I did some mica, and that's what the shiny stuff is, and then some grit paste and washi. Anyway, I think it looks pretty good. I might need to add to it, but there are my tags. Now, um... This one doesn't quite fit in here because it's so tall, so it's sideways. And then this one, I didn't fold the right way exactly, so it's a little sideways. But the rest fit perfectly. The other option is the Tim Holtz box, which has lower sides. So my tags fit just perfectly. Um, see how this one fits? So. The, there's options or you could make a box um, this one is from Dollar Tree you want to be careful some of them I think are not as wide as others my the tags are all three inches wide like I said except for that one that I folded a little incorrectly but they should fit in the Dollar Tree box if it's at least three inches okay just wanted to mention that really quick <laughs> I'm shutting mica everywhere <laughs> Um, and then I also had questions for items that I use throughout the 13 days. And I will have this list in the description below and also in my Facebook group. So if there's things that you want to pull out, maybe put in a bucket or something um, to have at the ready, this would be handy to take a look at. I did use some Tim Holtz stamps and products, so I listed those at the bottom. All right, so that will be in the description and in my Facebook group. All right, so let's take a look at today's freebie. Here it is. It's a tag, and I did something super cool here at the bottom. I'm so excited. I added a QR code. So if you want to, if you haven't yet, and you want to get the 13 days of tag kit, all you have to do is use your phone, and I'll show you how to do it, um, and it will take you to the uh, Etsy page. How cool is that? All right, so I have my son's phone that has, like, no charge, <laughs> and I need to put in his code. All right. And then once you are there, you want to pull up the camera. So here I am, I have the camera, and all I'm gonna do, can you see that? Is I'm gonna put my phone over the box. And then a little box will go around it, and you just click on open the QR code, and look, it takes you right to Etsy. Isn't that awesome? I love it. Um, it's still on sale, it says for 15 more hours, so it's half off right now if you wanna go grab it. All right, and that is as of Friday the 30th. Okay, so here we are. Here is our freebie. You can get this on my coffee page, which I will have linked in the description, as well as in my Facebook group. Okay, one other thing that I kind of, I think, helped me uh, stay organized <laughs> was I put all the different days in baggies. So I pre-cut and pre-inked, and then I put everything in little baggies. Not that you have to do that, um, but it was just something that helped me. And the other thing was, what if you don't have a box or you don't want to, you know, go to Dollar Tree and make a box? You could do something like this, obviously with a larger ring, but you could have all the tags on a ring and then kind of display them that way or have sets of them. Um, really, whatever you do is up to however you feel, whatever you would like to do. Um, I just noticed I didn't pre-fold my, my, um, my pocket. So I like to take a, a block, or you can take your um, scoreboard. 
but this kind of works and I just fold over my edges on the block and it kind of helps me get the fold started. Again, if you have your scoreboard ready to go, that works too. All right. One other thing, while you are, if you are getting inspiration from the videos um, that I did for the 13 days, you might want to <laughs> watch it and then replay it and follow along. Um, I had ideas in my head as I, you know, before I started the tag, but me, the videos are me actually kind of working through what I wanted to do while I was doing the tag. So you'll see a couple times where I'm like, I changed my mind a little bit. So you might want to watch it and then, um, you know, go back and decide, oh yeah, I want to do that. Or, oh, I like that, but I want to do this instead. I hope that makes sense. Instead of just like working on your tag as I'm working on my tag. I don't know. All right. I think... I think I'm gonna put this here. I'm tempted to just make a layer tag, but I do have the pocket here, but I kinda really want to do this. <laughs> and maybe add this over here. And then I could use this in my journal. See what I'm saying? As <laughs> I go through it, I kind of changed my mind. I am making a uh, kids and cats junk journal. So this pocket would look really cute also in my journal. So I don't know if I want to do a, a tag or, yeah, that would look really cute. So, and there's a bunch of tags also in the kit. I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to do two separate things. One for the tag kit and one for my journal. All right, so I am going to glue this on. All right, and the other idea with the tag kit, there is over 15 tags in the kit. Um, there's some bonus days after the 13th. Um, so I do go and kind of show you how I do day, what would it be, 14 and 15? So I'm calling them bonus days because I really wanted to stick with the number 13. <laughs> um, so if you print the kit twice, you would have enough tags for the entire month if you wanted to do a full October daily. Some people just like to do an October occasionally. <laughs> Some people like to do the full 31 days. So if you printed the kit and or mixed and matched with the journal kit, you would have well over 31 tags. And then there's other options. Like here, there's two tags. So if you wanted to separate them, you could do something like that as well. This up here and then you will have leftover items you know on the different days that you don't use so you might want to put those back in a ziploc bag or kind of keep those all right let's add some fabric it's a little wide to my tab like that So just a reminder, tomorrow is the first. So the first video will be tomorrow. And you might want to, um, if you haven't already, <laughs> uh, subscribe and then hit the notification bell so that you see when the video is um, live. And you can check it out. I'm so excited. All right, so I have those and those, I think. I'll stitch around later 
and there we go. So did I mention everything? I think I did. Again, you can grab the tags on the coffee page or my Facebook group, the QR code if you haven't bought the kit or head over to Kara Brandon Creations on Etsy. And I think that's all. If you have questions, please leave them in the comments so I can get back to you or message me in Facebook. Either one works and I'm super excited for this. I can't wait. And look, we can add this guy to our box. Isn't that cute? Or this one. Yay. <laughs> all right. I can't wait. I hope you join me and I can't wait to get Halloween crafty with you. <laughs> all right. Have a wonderfully crafty day. Bye-bye.